Hey guys, it's Nora. I'm with my friend Fabrizio and we have a really fun adventure plan for us today. As you can see, we have our metal detectors and we're currently walking to a beautiful beach packed with people and we'll be using our metal detectors to hopefully find some underwater treasure. So let's grab our gear and jump into the water and see what we can find. rougher than we'd like it to be. Um, I don't know if there's going to be much visibility today or if we could stay long because it's going to be really shaky in there. 72 hours later.
Spider-Man, Spider-Man. Okay, we just came out of the water. We washed our stuff, it's drying on the wall. We're gonna go back to the house and then we'll show you what we found today. All right guys, I'm gonna start with my trash finds. I found a couple of pull tabs and a bunch of aluminum pieces. This is not even all the aluminum I found. I threw most of it out already. Next, I have a lot of copper wire, tubes, flat pieces, and things like that. Next are the mystery pieces. If anyone knows what any of these pieces could potentially be from, please let me know because I have no idea. This one actually looks like it's embedded in a rock. It's very heavy. And this is probably my favorite mystery piece out of them all. It looks like it's to an engine or maybe like a boat engine. It's a really cool piece. I've never found anything like this. If you know what it's from, let me know. Here we have some more interesting metal pieces. They're all pretty flat. I thought this was a small coin at first, but it's very light and I don't see anything on it. So I think it's just a piece of punched out aluminum. Next, I have my coin finds of the day. I found a euro and 60 cents. Not too many coin finds, but these all look like they've been in there a very long time. And now for my favorite finds of the day, I found this little watch. I think it's been in there a long time because it's pretty banged up and I don't think it'll ever work again. And now for my best find of the day, I found this gold ring, guys. It's a beautiful little band. And on the inside, it's stamped 750. So it's an 18 karat gold ring. And there is a name on it. It says Ornella, O-R-N-E-L-L-A. And there's some dates in there. And the sad part about this is the date is from 1979 to 2004. So I don't know if this is someone's ring whose wife passed away and he got the date added when she passed. So if you guys know anyone with a wife or someone who passed named Ornella, please let me know and I want to try to get in touch with them and try to get this back to the person because I'm sure it holds a lot of sentimental value. And yeah, overall very good day. It's always a good day when you find gold and of course we removed a lot of trash as usual. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. Be sure to go over to Fabrizio's channel, watch his video from today and see what he found because he had some really cool finds. Give this video a thumbs up if you've enjoyed it, subscribe if you're new. Buy the merch if you want to support the channel and I'll see you guys next time. Bye! We're getting all the looks as usual. I don't like people for staring at us. We are on the common side of the road. <laughs> There's a bikini girl full of a strange equipment and a guy with a with a mask on the head. And <laughs> a bikini girl. <laughs>